This is from one of our viewers in Hawaii. Can you explain how telomeres lengthen and improve the quality of human life? I, mean, I can take that one. So, so I mean, telomeres, for those who don't know, are, are sort of the caps on the end of your chromosomes. So if you think about your shoelaces, they have a plastic endpoint to the shoelace, which stops those shoelaces fraying. And telomeres are sort of the molecular equivalent of that at the end of a chromosome. So every time your cell divides, you lose a little bit at the end of the, of the chromosomes, and the telomeres are a way to keep them from getting shorter. And as they, there's some evidence, and certainly in some cell types, that in a, in a lab condition, that uh, there comes a point where the chromosome becomes so, sh so short that the cell enters some sort of senescent phase and starts to sort of basically become a kind of old cell. And I think um, there are certainly links between telomeres and, and, and enzymes which can keep the ends of those chromosomes long, so can increase the, the length of those um, telomeres with age in terms of reversing some of those senescent phenotypes in the, in the lab and in, in the cell culture. I don't think yet we know if there's any particular links between telomerase and, and sort of human aging on, an, on a sort of more organismal level. I think from a cellular level, they're very critical, and I think it's one part of the process we need to look at. And in fact, some of the interventions which make model systems in the laboratory age sort of better have an effect on those telomeres. But I think as with aging is a complicated thing, it's not just due to one thing. So I would say it's, it's part of a, a multifactorial process.